Hello, stay tuned with daily news from Marjaya TV. Daily meetings of Grand Ayatollah Shibazi. The prominent Shia Islamic jurist Grand Ayatollah Shibazi hosts large numbers of religious scholars, seminary teachers, and students, religious experts, political figures, civil rights activists, academics, and public groups of people on a daily basis at his central office in Holy Kong. In these meetings, the visitors give reports on their activities and listen to the guidelines and advices of the Grand Jurist. The central office of the Grand Jurist hosts public visitors every day until noon prayers. Shias from India meet Grand Ayatollah Shubazi. Over the past few days, a group of Shia believers from India gathered at the central office of the Grand Ayatollah Shubazi and met with his eminence in person. In his remarks, the Grand Jurist referred to a hadith from the Holy Prophet and emphasized and said in the God's Messenger as a role model for having good morals. It is worth noting that the Yemeni Shia revered Dr. Isam al Imad was also at this meeting. Nonviolence Incorporation expresses concerns over humanitarian issues in Yemen. Nonviolence Incorporation, dependent to Imam Shiwazi World Foundation, released a statement to express its deepest concern over the ongoing deadly campaign against the people of Yemen. This statement reads as follows We at Nonviolence Incorporation follow up on the unfortunate events in Yemen, and we find it so distressing to see that the innocent and defenseless Yemeni people have fallen victim to these attacks. Nonviolence Incorporation is deeply concerned over the escalation of tensions and the expanding shadow of war in Yemen, which have taken as victim all groups of people. Hatred, vengeance, and death are the war souvenirs, which inflict the oppressed Yemeni people with more losses and damages. In the end, this statement reads, The Nonviolence Incorporation earnestly demands all belligerent parties to stop fighting and end the deadly ongoing campaign against Yemeni people. This human rights organization also calls for an end to the airstrikes by the coalition that have killed thousands of innocents so far. Rasul Alam Charitable Institute helps needy families. Coinciding with the birth anniversary of the Holy Prophet of Islam and Imam Sadiq, peace be upon them, the Charitable Institute of Rasul Alam in Holy Kaldimiya organized several religious and social programs in the city. In these programs, this institute distributes its humanitarian aids among the needy families, the families of the Iwaki martyrs and the orphans. Furthermore, Rasul Alam Institute held celebrations to honor the birth anniversary of the Holy Prophet of Islam and Imam Sadiq, peace be upon them.